Hi, I'm Rachel, and this is my author's answer video for November 2021. This is also a little bit of a test video in a couple of ways. Uh, first of all, this is a uh, repeat. <laughs> I had uh, filmed this video earlier, but uh, the uh, file was corrupted. <laughs> oh, this is like the worst time to be having that sort of problem with the camera because I'm doing so much vlogging for NaNoWriMo, but luckily I'm very good about uh, uploading as often as I can, so hopefully it won't affect too much of my vlogging and I can fix this easily. <laughs> the other way that uh, this is a test video is that, uh, well, the author's answer series uh, was started by J.D. Archer and his uh, writing group. Uh, J.D. Archer is an author tuber. Uh, they ask themselves a series of uh, reading and writing related questions. I've been doing these videos uh, for the last few years, uh, answering one question sequentially. Uh, JD and his uh, writing group uh, answered a lot of questions on JD's blog, which I will link down below. And then JD uh, filmed his own answers on uh, AuthorTube, but he only went up to question number 55. And today I am answering question number 56. So it's weird to kind of go ahead of JD in a way. I mean, not uh, in his first iteration with the writing group where he's answered several more questions on the blog, but certainly, uh, I'm not uh, able to listen to any of his uh, AuthorTube responses anymore, because there aren't any, but still I'll link to his AuthorTube playlist and my own down below. So with all that preamble out of the way, uh, question number 56 is to talk about uh, if you have any other uh, creative endeavors other than writing. Uh, and the big one for me uh, that I'm still involved with is singing. Uh, right now I am singing with my synagogue's flash choir, which is not, uh, I guess, a traditional sort of flash choir. You think of people who randomly, you know, go into song in a filmed environment. Uh, but uh, this uh, flash choir really means that uh, everybody uh, is on a list of I have interest in singing with the group, but I not signing up uh, definitely for every, uh, you know, event that comes along. We get an email for every event, you know, prior, of course, to say, hey, this thing is coming up. Do you have time? Are you interested to join us? And so you can uh, pick and choose in a way, like if you're too busy or something, I guess it's uh, the professional's uh, synagogue choir, I suppose, but uh, it uh, has been very fun. But I had been singing uh, since I was a young girl. Uh, when I was around uh, eight or nine, I joined what's uh, the Children's Chorus of Maryland, uh, which was a really great organization I was a part of uh, until uh, I graduated high school uh, and uh, went through the ranks of uh, learning about uh, music theory and about uh, si singing in uh, groups, uh, you know, sequentially more uh, uh, mature as uh, the years went on, uh, and I had amazing opportunities to sing in places like uh, the White House. Uh, uh, but the big one uh, was uh, in 1998, uh, I got to sing with my group as like uh, the featured group uh, at a Carnegie Hall uh, presentation of uh, children's choruses. So, so that was pretty amazing. And other than that, I uh, sang in, you know, my uh, school groups and, you know, middle through uh, middle school through college. Uh, other things I uh, do, uh, well, I played the piano as a kid as well. I took lessons. I still, you know, can uh, by memory uh, play a couple of pieces, but I haven't taken uh, lessons in forever. Uh, and when I was in college, a uh, roommate taught me how to knit, uh, you know, very uh, rudimentary stuff, basically just a line over and over again. So what I did that year was I made my mother a strip, a scarf. <laughs> Uh, and uh, that was pretty special, but I don't think I've knit since, so I'm pretty sure I'd be even more rudimentary now. But it does seem like it could be a fun uh, activity. You know, I know a lot of uh, booktubers uh, uh, knit or, or do more complicated uh, things, uh, and I'm sure it's especially good when you're listening to audiobooks, a <laughs> way to do two things at once. <laughs> So, yeah, uh, that, that about covers it for me now. Uh, I will leave a link to uh, the Children's Courts of Maryland down below. It's still an active group. Um, but in the meantime, I uh, really am only uh, writing as my only uh, big uh, creative outlet, unless you can call reading and perhaps booktubing, although I guess that's an easy answer to say on <laughs> booktube and author tube about creative endeavors and this is the captain obvious one <laughs> uh, but anyway i will be back on this channel in the next couple of days with my uh nano vlog 3 uh provided that i can get everything working and 
and uh, move past the corrupted files, uh, but I uh, don't think it'll be a big deal, so stay tuned. In the meantime, thanks so much for watching, everyone, and I'll see you next time.